welcome back to my channel. It is Caitlin here. Today I'm going to be doing a really exciting video, which is actually a follow-on and a part two to a video which I did nearly two years ago now. And just like in the last year, you guys have been loving it. Like, it has blown up. I mean, it's not like extreme, like it's not like some viral video, but for just for some reason, it is one of these constant videos that always I have people commenting on and messaging me about and like just it's always got something going on on that video and it's clearly something that you guys are interested in and something that's helping you guys and that is my video about small boobs. So I'm going to be doing a part two and this part two is going to be mainly focused on how to style small boobs and how to rock what you have or don't have and what I do and what I feel like personally works really well and kind of just tips and tricks that might make you feel a little bit more confident which I would probably have very much welcomed about five or six years ago when I was so crazily insecure about my very 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 small chest so I'm gonna share with you my tips and tricks and advice and style tips and all that sort of stuff so I hope you enjoy if you're interested in this makeup look I do have a video going up it may be up already if it is, link will be down in the description. If it's not, wait for it, it's coming. Don't you worry. Um, so let's get started. Number one is something which I do all the time and something which I feel like is one of the best things about being small chested and that is wearing strapless tops, bandeau tops, you know, tops that go straight across. I'm actually wearing one today, no straps. It is the most freeing and flattering, personally, top style and it's so popular right now you see people wearing these kind of tops on nights out on like during summertime you can wear them because you don't get no tan lines these kind of tops with no straps are like the best my favorite tops ever also what is so great about these obviously people with larger chests can't really wear them because they need straps to hold their large chests up but also what is so great about these kind of tops for people with small chests is they take away the attention from your like boob area and kind of focus it more on your top which is such a flattering part of your body like this area here so it really like elongates your neck also shows off your collarbones I just feel like this area is more the attention is on this area and not anything below so wearing tops like this just draws the attention elsewhere and also to places that are super flattering and are just as feminine as the chest area. Tip number two, another thing which I'm rocking right now is jewellery. This is something that I would highly recommend if you've got a small chest. Having little bits of jewellery, layering or just long like thin chains going like down this area, it removes the attention away from your chest area. It makes this area also look more interesting if you're a little bit insecure about like nothing really going on down here. If you've got jewellery then that's something that is making you feel more confident and also something that's making that area look more exciting and looking a little bit more pizzazz. Do you know what I mean? Also like I'm super super flat chested, let's get this straight, but if you've got like a little bit going on down there and you've got jewellery like let's say like a really long necklace it can really flatter that area because it shows that there's like a little bit of like curve I don't know what I'm talking about here you know what I mean maybe but just jewelry is again another tip which I do all the time I don't take my necklaces off they stay here all the time style tip number three is down to casual clothing being small chested you're probably the most gifted person in the world when it comes to casual clothing because it's just the easiest thing to wear like you can wear baggy t-shirts, you can wear like dungarees, that kind of vibe and it doesn't look ridiculous and you don't look like you've squeezed into like your children's dungarees basically because if you've got a small chest it ain't a problem. Also if you've got a really really large chest sometimes when you wear baggy clothing it can make it like your chest look even bigger because it just kind of like it looks like you're wearing a bin bag basically but if you've got a small chest like your top just sits nicer on you, it just doesn't look so drowning, it just is a little bit more flattering. Also, along with the casual baggy clothing, wearing men's clothing is a lot easier when you've got a small chest as well. Don't know why, just, I just feel like it's so much more flattering. You can style men's clothing how and when you wish. So definitely give that one a try if you're maybe a little bit more tomboy or you just wanna switch up your style. Men's clothing works really well with small chest. Tip number four, 
If you're like me and you love a good bralette, then definitely being small chested is a godsend. I have the most beautiful bralettes and I can wear them all the time. I don't need to wear a proper structured bra every day of the week. I can just wear comfy, pretty bralettes every single day because I don't actually need the structure of a regular bra to like hold anything. You don't need to show them off or wear like skimpy clothing to let people see. It's more just like the comfort angle because they're just so much more comfortable. But don't get me wrong, if you want to show them off, do it. Do it. Tip number five, a style which you can 100% pull off and is pretty much only for small chested people and that is halter necks. The style of a halter neck is so flattering for people with small chest. It kind of makes the area look bigger than it is because it's coming from your neck all the way down. So it's making that area larger, there's like more material going on in your chest so it just it just makes things look bigger, which is basically what you want when you've got a small chest. And the chances are, if you're watching this video, that's probably what you're wanting. So halter necks are your best friend. That's that. Tip number six when styling at the beach, bandeau bikinis are my go-to. I think they are much easier to wear and also you don't get any tan lines. If you want to, you can wear halter neck bikinis if you want something a little bit more fancy. But bandeau, halter neck, stick to those on the beach. They make me feel the most confident and they make me feel less flat chested. Does that make sense? Tip number seven, we are on number seven, is high waisted clothing, high waisted jeans, high waisted skirts. Anything high waisted brings the attention to your waist. So you can use a belt or you can just use the waistband to like bring in your waist, make it look smaller, give yourself some curves. Also, just generally, if your trousers are higher, like you've got high waisted clothing going on, it brings the focal point of your outfit to your waist and not to your chest. So people aren't so interested in what's going on up there, more just what's going on right in the middle. Moving on to tip number eight, it's very similar to tip number seven and that is crop tops also bring the attention to your waist because obviously crop tops, you've got your belly out so people are kind of looking at that area on your body and not your chest area. So exactly the same as high-waisted trousers, Crop tops are also great at bringing the attention to another area of your body, which I'm sure is very flattering. Tip number nine is a small style tip from me, and that is horizontal stripes are great for people with small chests because they kind of exaggerate the curves on your body. You can really see where your figure is when you're wearing stripes, so wearing that when you've got a small chest gives you more illusion of curves basically. And then finally, tip number 10 is if you have the confidence and if you wanna do it, you definitely can, and that is rocking the side boob and also rocking braless. I'm currently not wearing a bra today. I do it quite a lot because it's freeing and comfy, but if you wanna do side boob as well, you totally can if you've got enough going on there because it's probably not gonna fall out anywhere. You know, everything is just kinda of staying where it should stay. So if you wanna do a little bit of like something edgy, you can totally do it. Go ahead, have the confidence. Okay, so those were all my 10 tips for rocking a small chest and styling your clothes to make it look a little bit more flattering. My final thing, which I do wanna say, which is probably my most important piece of advice to you guys, is your posture and your confidence with what you're wearing is probably the most important thing in this whole video. Posture, standing up straight, being confident in how you look and how you feel makes everything look 10 times better and people will just not even bother with how big or small your chest is. So have the confidence, have the posture and you'll be fine. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye guys.